The fellas down here in the restoration shop with the A-Team want to show you the projects we got coming up. We got a six-cylinder Kawasaki KZ1300. It's kind of a rare piece. You don't see too many of these. We got a YZ60 Yamaha, an XLCH Cafe Racer that uh, Mario has been working on for a couple months now. This is a complete custom fabricated. Um, it's got a Ninja Kawasaki front end on it, a huge oil cooler, custom handmade exhaust that Mario crafted here. A dual exhaust that's a really cool piece that's coming down to pike mario's also done a frame off on this harley davidson 73 iron head sportster that's a kick-ass piece man right down to every nut and bolt on that thing he's doing a crank seal on this 86 cr2 uh, atc 250 this is a really nice super clean survivor these are super rare most of these got written into the ground so this will be doing some killer videos and all these we got an mr50 billy's going through uh, Manic Mechanic had this right down to the crank, completely rebuilt the, the rebuilt this thing from uh, a pile of parts, and uh, it's looking pretty good. We got a YZ490 over here. Um, this is looking pretty fresh. This is a, uh, what year is this, what year is this one, do you know? It's 80, 80, 82, yeah. So that was a four-speed still. Looking beautiful. Look at this thing. We've had a lot of beautiful YZs coming through the shop. And look at the forks on that thing. Just beautiful. Full DG pipe. Um, gold, original factory gold wheels with a nice gold chain to match. Got a nice YZ80. What year is this one? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm going to say 82. Yeah. Looks like an 82 to me. Pretty super clean. Thing, super clean. Nice. Yeah, this would be like brand new, man. Most of those got wheelied into into a pile of parts by uh, young young kids. What's happening, Squirrel? Oh, nothing to it, my main man. You got this motor looking pretty good here. I'm trying here. to make the magic happen to it. I'm going to make the magic happen to it. I promise you that. You got, got another, this is another six-cylinder cow. We had three of these come in. I don't know if you remember the pick that we did a couple months back where the, the um, guy had passed away up in uh, Wareham, Massachusetts, and his kids sold us uh, two container loads full of... Um, we're using a little contact cleaner on it? Yes, sir. Getting Trying to see point. what kind of work I got to do to it, my man. If I get it clean, I might not have to touch it too much. He's already, you already steam cleaned it and looks like it cleaned it up pretty nice. It was pretty dusty. It had like 10 years of dust on it. This thing runs like a like a top. Uh, the Manic Mechanic rebuilt. This is a this is a three two-barrel carburetors. Makuni's really rare c configuration. But you don't see these six-cylinder inline sixes too often. So this will be a really cool piece when it's done. That's got to get all put back together. Um, got another YZ over here, YZ250. This thing's super fresh. Really, really, really rare piece. Um, this is original, too. That's original paint on the cylinder right there. Uh, original pegs. Just absolutely stunning time capsule. The boys are going through this and giving it a super nice cleanup. Then we got another police machine. We had two of these through here. This is the, the better of the two. It's just in here for the uh, cosmetics part of the restoration. It's been mechanically gone through completely by uh jeff manic mechanic did that one too we got another yz60 we got a honda honda matic 400 a 504 that's getting a steiger graphics package then we've got a, a suzuki v-strom so stay tuned we're getting ready for the auction that we're is launching next friday um and ending the following sunday for uh i think we have 60 some odd of the 180 bikes ready and they're already staged in the ebay um scheduled listings so they'll be coming down the pike quite a few classic bikes 181 of them i'm not sure how many will be ready for prime time by uh, the time the auction starts but we got 60 ready now and we got really two weeks to fit the auction starts next friday and ends the following sunday so we really got almost a couple weeks so we got this is just one of the shops we have two shops 18 guys working here so we can turn out quite a few bikes so stay tuned. You'll see all these bad boys running and uh, me doing my uh, wheelies on them up the driveway, hopefully. <laughs> God willing. That's the best part. I get the best part of the job. I get to ride these things up to these guys. Shine them up nice. What's happening, Ronnie? What's up, man? How you doing, kid? Good, good. This is Ronnie Brooks. He uh, is our Instagram social media guy. So all the videos and pictures you see on Instagram, that's, that's Ronnie making it happen. This MR50 is looking pretty fresh, man. Yes, sir. What you getting, man? Need a little touch up here and there, but other than that, it's 
getting there. You should have it running. Do a wheelie on this. So it's Memorial Day. It's raining outside, and uh, these guys decided they'd rather come to work today instead of take the, the holiday and uh, um, make the magic happen here on the bike. So we're all here, me and Junior. And, and if you watch the other video, you see we had 10 bikes come in today, 10 kick-ass bikes. Ronnie, thanks for making the magic happen down here. Thank you, sir. Mario's out racing, so we won't see him till tomorrow. But I hope to see you guys up at Unadilla at MX Rewind next weekend. And hopefully some of you guys see something you want to buy here in the auction because almost all these bikes will be ready for the auction that's coming up. I don't know if the 180 of them that we got will be ready, but a lot of them will be ready. We've also got this KX250 coming down the pike. We've got a snow runner that should be in the auction and a four-wheel bike over there. Nice Elsinore 250. This Kajiba 550 is coming up real soon. This thing's going to be sick. An SL350. A YZ125, Yamaha 360, another SL350, Suzuki TS400, CR125, TS125, a GS1000E, another CR500, an XS11 Special, XS850, another XS1100, another six-cylinder KZ1300, TS400, XR80, Kawasaki 350, Bighorn, a CR250, an old ATC four-stroke 250, I think, a Hodaka. I think this is a Combat Wombat. I'm not really sure. Um, a DT50 Yamaha, rare, rare bird, and an old XL70. A couple of P-dubs, a couple of P-dubs, and this is a really super rare Harley-Davidson MX250. Another SL350. P-dub number three, and a super clean CX-500 Deluxe. No miles, 8,000 miles, it'll clean up like a new penny. You got a Wizard 2 500. Hell yeah, 1997, my favorite year. Just like you are. Man, that's not The kickstand's making a vibrating noise. Pipe fighter. Looks good, man. Wizard tune, it'll be perfect when he's done. I promise you that. Got a sweet little GS 250 commuter coming up, crusty old KE 175. We're gonna restore. And then we got a uh, Valkyrie that um, <coughs> was hit by a deer. Now we got the parts, so we're gonna fix that one up. And of course, old faithful big black. I love this bike, one of my favorite bikes. And this old dog's been sitting out here for a while, she's going up for auction next week, too.